Sandra Lee Fewer, and I am the supervisor of District 1. I moved to the Richmond District in 1959. I was two years old. I moved from Chinatown. I was born in Chinese Hospital, and we were one of the first Asian families to move out here. When my mother decided to buy that house on 16th Avenue, nobody knew where it was. It seemed so far away. For a long time, we were the only Chinese family there. But we started to see the areas of Clement Street grow to serve a larger Chinese population. And I think the stretch of Clement Street that we are seeing here was sort of the birthplace of that. My father would have to go to Chinatown for dim sum. And I remember one day he came home and said, there's one on Clement Street now. And then it just started to grow very organically. It is the same thing with our Russian population, which there really is another very large ethnic group in the Richmond district, is that as Russians started to move in, we started to see more Russian stores serving the foods that they are used to, that they like to see. And so part of the Richmond, I believe, is very concentrated with a Russian community, an immigrant Russian community, and also a Chinese immigrant community. I think us living here in the Richmond, we really appreciate the fact that we are surrounded by three natural barriers, and they are beautiful barriers. The Presidio, which gives us so many trails to walk through, Ocean Beach, the families that um, can just go to the beach and be actually in the Pacific Ocean. It also has Lands Inn, which is now a national park service. We border the GGNRA, the Golden Gate National Recreation Area, so there is a lot of activities to do. In the summertime, you'll see people with bonfires in the evenings, but really just families enjoying the beach and the Pacific Ocean during the rest of the time of the year. And then Golden Gate Park, where we have you know, so many of our treasures here the tea garden, we have the museums, and also the Academy of Sciences, not to mention all the wonderful playgrounds that we have here in the Richmond. So this is why I always say the Richmond is a really great place, quite frankly, for families. The Balboa Theater is a treasure in our neighborhood. It has been around for a very long time. It is one of our two neighborhood theaters that we have here. The other one is the Four Star. I moved into Richmond District in 1959 when I was two years old, so the Four Star was my theater um, that we would always go to. I love these neighborhood theaters, and the Balboa, I think, is one of these places that is not only a landmark here in the Richmond District, but also in San Francisco. These small theaters showing one or two films, I think, are unique also to our neighborhood, but also unique to San Francisco. Where we are today on Clement Street really is the heart, I think, of the Richmond District. What's unique about Clement Street is that it's all small businesses and there isn't formula retail here. It is mom and pops really opening up a business here and um, providing for the neighborhood. And this is what we love about Clement Street. The Clement Corridor, Commercial Corridor, starts from Clement Street and it goes all the way down, in fact, to the end of Clement. You will see some small businesses even toward 32nd and Clement. The core of it re is really right here uh, between Arguello and 10th Avenue. When we see this variety of stores offered here on Clement Street, I think it is very unique to any other part of San Francisco. The Plow and Stars, traditional Irish music, which you don't get hardly anywhere in San Francisco, some place like the Toy Boat that has this long legacy of serving ice cream and being a hangout for families to have a, a Sunday afternoon ice cream. And then also we see these grocery stores such as Mei Wa and also these restaurants that are just new here but also thriving. We are seeing not only some restaurants being switched over by hands, new owners, but what we are seeing is sort of the vibrancy of Clement Street still being recaptured with the new businesses that are coming in. And I think that's a really great thing to see. I don't know when I started to shop at Maywa Market, but it was probably a very, very long time ago. So I like to cook a lot, and I like to cook Chinese foods. So Maywa Market is a place I come to probably once a week. Um, what I like about Maywa Market is that it is very affordable, as fresh produce, as fresh meats, also seafood, but they also offer a large selection of condiments and sauces and noodles. 
The variety of rices that they have is tremendous. I don't think you can find a variety like that anywhere else. Hi, I'm Kevin Wong. I'm the manager for Richmond New Meiwa. In 1989, we moved our store from Chinatown to Richmond District. We have opened for a bit over 29 years. We carry products from Thailand, Japan, Indonesia, Vietnam, Singapore, and India. We try to keep everything fresh daily so our customer can get the best out of it. Normally during crab season in November, this is the first place I hit because they have really fresh crabs here. And this is something that my family really loves for me to make. Also, for my traditional Chinese foods, I love to make an oxtail stew. This is where I come to my back cut of meat, and they can cut it to the size that I really want. I would say I'm here probably about once a week. I'm very familiar with the aisles. I know everyone who's the cashier here. I know that when people may come into a market such as this, which looks like an Asian supermarket, which it is, and sometimes it can be intimidating. Because if you don't speak the language and many of the labels are in Chinese, you might not know where, what to buy or if it's the proper ingredients for the recipe that you're trying to make. In fact, I do see a lot of people here with a recipe card or sometimes with a Bon Appetit magazine and they are looking for specific items. The staff here is very, very helpful. I speak very little Chinese myself things that I'm not sure about. I always ask the clerks here and I say, is this what I need for soup or is this what I should be making? And they actually, they actually really help me. They will bring me to the aisle and say, this is better. And I think they're very knowledgeable, very friendly. I think Meiwa is here to serve not only the Asian community, but to serve all communities here in the Richmond District and in San Francisco. What's wonderful about living here in the Richmond is that even though our Julys are very foggy and overcast. I just think this neighborhood, this sleepy part out here on the west side is so rich with history, but also with, rich with all the amenities that offer to, they can offer to families.